Hello everyone, welcome back. If you are new to my channel and you love everything DIY, please don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell to be notified every time I upload a video. So guys, in today's video, I thought I would share with you a cool IKEA pin board hack. So before we go ahead and get started, here are a few supplies you will need. You will need an IKEA picture frame, a cork board and any type of fabric. Now that I have all of my supplies in hand, next I went ahead and dismantled my picture frame and prepped it for its next step. Afterwards, I went ahead and used the plastic insert that I got for my picture frame and used it as a template and traced it down onto my cork board. Once I was done tracing out my template, I then used an X-Acto knife and cut out my desired shape. At this stage guys, you could use any size or type of picture frame you already got in hand and cut out the cork board to the desired size. Now that my shape is cut out, the next step is to go ahead and glue my fabric onto my cork board. Here you see me using spray adhesive which I sprayed onto my cut out cork board. After I was done spraying my cork board with my adhesive spray, I then went ahead and placed my fabric on top. Next, I went ahead and smoothened my fabric onto my cork board, rubbing it down well. Once I was done smoothing it out, I set it aside to dry. Now my fabric is all dry and the next step is to cut it to shape. Here I am using my scissors to cut the fabric to the shape of my cork board. So guys, at this stage you could use any type or color of fabric you already got in hand. I went with the natural look so I decided to use some jute fabric which I've already got in hand. Now my cork board is all done and now it's time to put this frame back together. So guys, putting this frame back together was so simple and easy to do. All I did was I placed the cork board instead of the plastic insert. Now my pin board is all done and you could use it as it is. But I still wanted to add something so I decided to add a bow onto it. Here I'm using a jute ribbon which I've already got in hand that I tied into a bow. Afterwards, I went ahead and used another piece of jute ribbon and formed it into a loop. Next, I glued my loop onto my frame and afterwards glued my bow onto my loop. Once my bow was all glued in, I set it aside to dry and then using my scissors I trimmed the edges. So guys, this is how my pin board turned out. I loved how simple and easy it was to do and how beautiful it turned out. Hope you guys like it too. 